Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to the Gaming Griffin. This is our XCOM Enemy Unknown playthrough. And we have managed to mostly stabilize some of the regions. We haven't lost anyone if we can make it to the end of the month. In point of fact, we actually got a bonus. We have, I believe, South America. And we're coming up, we need to get a satellite in Mexico and we would get North America. But, I think, if I remember correctly, we might have, we have ways of making you talk. Commander, I realize our troops have to put their own survival first, but every alien we use explosives against is one less opportunity to recover new artifacts. I know, I know, I know. So, yeah, I can do these instantly. The Tall One has, up until this point, been unofficially referred to as the Thin Man. Initial testing has revealed a concerted effort by the aliens to modify this specimen's genetic structure in such a way as to make it appear human. However, on closer inspection, we seem to have had some trouble concealing the eyes, which appear to be reptilian in nature. Very creepy. Oh, nice. Okay, so I did the Thin Man autopsy and I caught the improved med kit. That's pretty awesome. Flexible physiology of the Thin Men has given us new ideas for improving our med kits. We can increase 50% of the healing delivered in single charge. That's pretty awesome. All right, um, well, hey, if we have ways of making this- This is the most physically aggressive specimen we've discovered so far, which the troops fondly refer to as the Muton. I can only assume there's a colorful backstory for such a designation. <laughs> Let's see here. Over two meters tall, jeez. Highly durable, very lightweight, nice. Ammo Conservation Project. Okay. Let's see what this gives us. Muton armor contains servo motors that function as automatic weapon loaders, allowing their weapons to carry more ammunition without requiring the soldier to pay pause for a full reload. We could apply some of the same techniques to our weapons. New project. Alright. Well, the foundry's gonna be busy for a little while, isn't it? Might as well do chrysalid. Based on what we've seen in the field so far, including several grotesque examples of trauma resulting from the emergence of its young, we've taken to calling this specimen a chrysalid. Let's see. Conquered something beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. All right. Yeah, these are these are creepy aliens. Chitin plating. I, guess, I think that's how you say it. Chitin, maybe? I think it might be chitin. Chitin. Eh. Available for manufacture. What's it? Called? Light plating made from chrysalid exoskeleton. This material provides additional protection and a significant reduction to melee damage sustained. Huh. Well, isn't that interesting? Okay. That cleared some nice stuff off. I don't have any more autopsies, so... We will just go back to this. Well, that, that actually got some nice things. I'm- I'm dead broke. But let's see here. Yeah, that- that's the problem. I am dead broke right now. And all these take some money. Stealth satellites? Alright. Well, the good news is... Huh. Project completed. That's kind of weird, okay. Well, unfortunately, I am out of money and just kind of hoping to limp along until the council report. So... Hello. Tech 
tactical. Do we have an eagle over these coordinates? Recon satellite Delta II is just coming into line of sight now, sir. Coming on screen. Nothing. No. That's impossible. I know it's there. Switch to thermal. Hello. Give me subsurface. Gotcha. Reestablish comms with all available ground. Think of what we might find once we get inside that facility. Imagine what they might be doing down there. I'm sure we'll find out soon enough. Okay, we found it. Now how do we get inside? I thought you'd never ask. involved in creating these crystals, an organic machine capable of complex communications. We could spend years studying this technology. For now, we're just gonna go blow up our base when we have a few to spare a minute. <laughs> so skeleton key, huh? Okay. Fun times. Alright, so if our next job is to actually go and try and romp them, stomp them in their base... Let's see. Hmm. Precision lasers. I'm guessing that's probably the sniper rifle, if I had to guess. Come on, scroll faster. New fighter craft. Skeleton suit. Plasma pistol. Huh. Or illyrium. Or heavy lasers. Thinking. I think I'll do skeletons. Yes. I can only imagine what the aliens might be doing in an underground facility. Nothing good comes to mind, Doc. Nothing good. So let's see here. So we've got an alien base right there. Well, aren't you just happy fun times? So Africa is getting not so great times. <laughs> Satellite coverage now available over cool. Brazil. Incoming transmission. We are extremely impressed with the progress of the XCOM project thus far, Commander. Your recent results were beyond our expectations. And that is not a statement this council makes lightly. Happy to happy to oblige. Alright, so we've got South America, that's the We Have Ways. That's how we got all the uh Instant autopsies. Expert knowledge because we threw our base down in Europe. We are one satellite away from North America, which would be very awesome. Alright, carry on. Remember, we will be watching. Alright, let's prioritize. Because we just got our funding for the month. I've got a hunch as to how we might get into that facility. Just give the word, and I'll begin manufacturing the key immediately. Buy slash build items. Oh. Okay. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. Okay. I need to build an access lift. Oh. Yeah, okay. That's a lyrium generator is five days away from being operational, which will give me the power I need. Alright. Yeah, I can't even build it. Because what I need to do is I need to put an access lift, and I need to throw a satellite up like I should. Oops. Son of a... Alright, well I guess I'm gonna have to do something over there too. Okay. And I think I have an improved satellite, but I need a satellite uplink and I need to build some satellites. All right, why don't we at least get started on the satellites? Commander, our current satellite uplink facilities are at full capacity. We should build additional uplinks as soon as possible to allow for new satellite deployments. All right. If, I'm, I'm hoping, I'm hoping really hard that two satellites will deal with any panic that I managed to get if, through this month. 
I'm hoping. So we'll put two of those on order and they can get those working. As soon as they get more power in, I can build the satellite uplink and hopefully have the uplink ready to go by the time the end of the month flows around. <laughs> Things are interesting. I need more chrysalid corpses to make that, huh? I could make some of this, though. Hmm, 16. 16's not too shabby. <laughs> I'm only probably going to do one thing for the troops. So I think that'll be it. That's your upgrade for the month, boys. Good luck. Alright. And then foundry. Hmm. I hate to say it, but I'm going to save my money. Kind of got a lot going on. Alright. Let's let's see when the generator comes online. Commander, we're detecting a new contact, much larger than anything we've previously encountered. Uh -oh. I recommend we scramble our best equipped fighters if we're going to engage that ship. Yeah, this isn't gonna be fun times. It's probably going to destroy this ship. Not good. Because I have not upgraded my fighters at all. We're in pursuit. I may very well have to go. Taking heavy fire! Disengaging. Ooh. Yeah, he's a bit out of my league. Contact detected. Yeah, that's not good. I I can't take him. I need to upgrade my fighters, but I need to keep people from panicking. Welcome to resource management, XCOM style. Not ideal, but not much I can do. Let's see. Request from South Africa. Sext sectoid corpses. I have 35 in stock. Pharmaceutical company. Um, enjoy. Three more scientists. Fun times. Try new research. Skeleton suits are available for manufacture. Unfortunately, I can't... Don't have the money right now, unfortunately. Well, actually, I didn't know. I got scientists, not money, which is... Eh, what are you gonna do? I need to get these in the I appreciate your efforts to support the research team, Commander. I've already put the new recruits to work in the lab. Hey, enjoy. Alright. Three days until that generator comes online. There we go. Illyrium generator complete. Alright, hopefully that will deal with our power quite nicely. I wonder. How much do you produce? I'm wondering if I could take this thing offline. I've got a lot of spare. Uh... Oh my, 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 my. Those facilities. It's kind of like I wish I could see what I could build. Alright, I got one day till that excavation's done. I can check it then. I can I'll gamble it for for a second here. There we go. Okay. Now oops, wrong wrong one, wrong one. Engineering. No facilities. Alright. How much do you how much power do you provide? So you're providing all of like eight lousy power? I got eight power to spare. And a satellite nexus would be awfully nice. And if I put it next to that other one, it would provide me some very, very shiny 
I do believe we're going to decommission the old one. I'm kind of taking a little bit of a risk. There we go. Yeah, and I still have enough power to play with, so... Satellite Nexus is 300. I have just enough mana. Whew, glad I didn't do anything else. Okay. So that will... 21 days. It'll be mm, tricky. 26 every month, but... Yeah, I really need one of these. Unfortunately, I don't think there's enough- well, yeah, I think it would just squeak in before the end of the month. So if we have something really go- go sideways on us, we could probably recover the panic. Maybe. Alright. Let's continue research. Raven 2's back online. Oh, hello. Commander, we have multiple reports of new abductions in progress. The locations are marked on the Hologlobe. Of course you do. Alright, you're very low panic. Not likely going there. You're low panic. Probably not going there. Huh. Now isn't that an interesting one? These are all relatively lower panic. India's got the highest. Alright, so this one, this one you actually have to take into account. 200 would be very nice. Funds are what I what make me cry right now. But I already have the bonus from this area. I do not have the bonus for India, I don't believe. I also don't have Africa's either. Now that doesn't move me any towards it, but it's a where do I want to burn the satellites and that's kind of the question. I don't want to burn satellites here, because I won't get anything for doing it. However, if I throw a satellite in either of these areas, it'll work me towards the continent bonus. And this is kind of the, the thought pattern you have to go through here. On the other side, a support unit would be awesome. And scientists are always handy people, but... Oof. You know, for his, you'd think this was an easy one, but it's actually not. It's actually fairly complicated. I think we're going to go for the one in our backyard. We are really hurting for resources right now. So, we are gonna head over to Birmingham, I do believe. There's, there's, one, there's reasons to go to all of them, honestly. This new body armor was developed using what we've learned from the alloys employed in the alien ship. It should prove to be both lighter and stronger than anything we've used in the past. Oh yeah. Alright. So he should be he should be pretty tough running in right now. Do I have any better weapons? I do. Alright, I have a laser rifle. pistol. Say hello to my little friend. Customize. That's kind of interesting. <laughs> ah, okay, I was gonna say, he doesn't look quite right. Ah, now that... That's just the upgraded look of what I had before, and I, you know what? I'm, I'm willing to go for that one. All right. So that's that's our assault unit tricked out. Um, no, our medic should hopefully be back up and running. Hello, medic. You're another one that I really want, and a good one. I wish I had an improved medic. Yeah, no, you're sticking on the 
medkit. Mostly equipped. Unfortunate, but oh well. What are you gonna do? And as for you, oops. Ranking, but it's it's good to get them up and running. Alrighty, let's see what we can do. We have visual on the mission site. Setting down. The next deployment site is in the UK. We've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. Okay. Roger, Big Sky. Reading you five by five. Strike one has the green light for deployment. Okay. Hmm. Well, I've seen worse. Alright, let's see here. You... There's probably something in this building if I had to guess. Tricker by now. Alright, let's see here. You know what? Oh, take a look behind the door here. Chance. I'll take it. 
What was that? Enemy in sight. Ooh. Yeah, they're not real happy about that one. I think I managed to pull the surprise on them. There's something out there. Ooh, he's not in great position. Alright, let's see here. Okay, we know they're over there. Let's give you some cover. And you wait for them to say hello. You also get some cover in that direction. And wait for them. Ditto. Let's see if they'll come to us. Come on, come on, come on. Booby. Bye bye. Very nice, very nice. There should be one more if I had to. Usually they come in threes. I'm not sure right now. Get a read on that thing. What its the? movements are so inconsistent. I'm sure my team would love to get their hands on that thing. Oh, my word. Yeah, okay. This just turned a little bit not fun happy times. Damn it! 
did notice that. everybody please incoming fire all right so what are you gonna do ah! oh you're gonna get a very good shot off aren't you all right you 40 20 um let's hold on you Finish that, please. Seriously? I'll get him next time. Alright, what kind of a shot do you have? One lousy damage? Alright, alright. Um, he needs some love. She's not in real great shape either, though. It's half my problem. No smokes. He's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. She's got one, two, three, four, five, six. I'm gonna use this one on her. I was really hoping somebody would be well, I'm not completely out of love here. Let's see if we can do this. I'm about to start keeping score. Alright. You're my last They're falling back. immediate problem. This sorry butt can he can fall back for a minute here. I would love it's a killing time. Time. 
medic. I am unfortunately out of heals after this one. Med kits fix everything. Calm <laughs> down. Med kits fix everything. That's like duct tape. <laughs> All right. Let's see here. No sight of him. Huh? Okay. Well, you've been in worse shape. Let's get you over here at least. Watch just in case. I doubt she's gonna see it. Um, ooh, do I overwatch or do I reload? I'm gonna overwatch. <laughs> Hopefully that doesn't come back to bite me. Oh crap! Are you serious? Hi. Did you hear something? Contact. Son of a. Do not hit him. All of you missed him. Nailed him. him. Enemy is still alive. I what was that? About ready to murder the lot of you. Alright, alright. Not good, not good. They are kind of on the flanking end. Where did you come from, you little. I guess I didn't see all the way back there? Kinda weird. Alright, I'm pretty sure there's. I think it's up here. Did it drop down? Can I do that? No, not really. Is that a telescope? I hope it's a telescope with uh, orbital death ray. Alright. Um, that's not ideal at all. Let's overwatch. You just live to make my life complicated, don't you? We still have a muton running around here. That's, that's not making me a happy camper. Alright. You know what? Screw it. I'm gonna run a gun it either way. Down. Worst case, I can get an eye on the mutant on whoever he is over here. I'm gonna see if I can get a eyes on that. S I swear I saw a second one. I knew there was one there. Forty-six percent chance to hit. I've I've gotten lucky. See you in hell. All right, that could have been. Not fun, unhappy times. Alright, you come. On. Ditto. We've still got a mutant running around. I want him dead. <laughs> Straight There's down something the out there. Alright. I'm hoping there's not another sectoid.
can't suppress. I still have a really crappy shot, so let's overwatch it. Alright, where can you get to? Oof. How gutsy do I feel? Not that gutsy. Alright, do you have any rockets left? Unfortunately not. Now, I don't want to cluster these up because mutons have this very unhappy, unpleasant habit of throwing out grenades. So I'd really almost rather he came to me. We'll be honest. Oh, he, so he's on Overwatch now. That makes my life very, very unpleasant. That's ourselves a standoff, huh? Alright, we're gonna get Let's you this. You're the only one with a shot. Which means I should be... Again, I, I hate clustering up, though. That's gonna be a good chunk of my problem. Alright. Now, we're gonna send the heavy. That's... that's... You've got a beautiful shot. If he pokes his head out, you've got you've got fun times coming there. No shot. Yep. If I can't get a shot, neither can he, so. Another successful operation. Whew. That one was um, cyber discs, I think is what they called it. And that was not fun time. Whoa, South Africa went all the way to Red Panic? critically wounded, just wounded, so I'm... I'll take what I can get. So a cyber disc and a drone. I, I must have blown that up with the, uh... rocket. I don't regret it at all. Silly panic has increased across Africa, across... We will be in touch, Commander. Alright, so how much did their panic increase? Because they were not sitting on... There must be some way to get into that base. I wonder what Dr. Shen has in mind. Wow. They went all the way. They were not sitting that rough, I didn't think. Huh. Oh well, I'm gonna have to deal with that one as it comes there. I've, I'm hoping I can get my satellites up and running before they panic and duck out. That's about all I can really do. Oh well. For now, that'll do it. That's enough, that's enough fun times for me. We'll check out those new aliens and try and deal with all this widespread panic later. So for now, this is the Gaming Griffin, signing off.